Alright guys, and welcome back to more Bravely Default. The wind is back, the king is gone, and we are about to attempt to do a side quest this episode that requires us to go to the windmill at night. Hopefully we can do it now. If not, we'll just continue with the story. So what we need to do right now is literally come outside. We might be able to go to Eulania Woods now. Maybe the wind has blown away the darkness. Departing already, Lady Vestal. Forgive me, I am Prime Minister Dominus Harina. Your words to the people shook me to my core. Between you and me, I suspect they rattled the king's cage as well. He looked positively deflated. Small wonder, having his little speech so thoroughly derailed must have been a blow to his royal ego. It will recover though, it always does. Meanwhile, where will you go from here? To Florum, land of radiant flowers. And the water oh. crystal. Nice. I see. But how will you manage the journey with seas unnavigable? The inner sea was spared by some merciful stroke of fate. But no port or sandy shore exists on the Florum side. You might travel by land, but the forests along the way are suffused with a noxious fog. The path is most dangerous. Seems we're blocked on all sides. Any ideas? No. But the sage of the Yuliana woods may know some way. Ah, what did I just say? Then it's to the airship and to Yuliana and beyond. Say the word, Agnes, and I shall lend wings to your every whim. Just to Yuliana, please. Yuliana. Yuliana. I was calling it Yulania. I think I was getting confused with Makalania. That's what happened. But look at this. There's a side quest here. Look at that. The blue exclamation point at the bottom of the screen which you can't see right now now you should be able to see there's a blue exclamation mark whenever we see those those are side quests and I think it is better if we try to attempt to do those early on as we go along with the game so every time we see a blue exclamation mark before we head on to continue the story we should probably like focus on doing the blue exclamation marks the side quest basically the minister's generosity ah leave it to the prime minister he thought of everything Hmm, what did he give us? It's a piece of paper, great. Don't be shy, all right, don't be silly, my angel. This is the bill of goods. They'll be sent to the ship later. First off, there's the food. He's arranged for bread, cured meat, salted grass beans. Damn, fruit, celery, green turnips, two barrels of pickled pink eggplant. He hooked us up, clock tower brand Faraga sauce. Damn, I love my hot Faraga sauce. Then a barrel of Anchimes most tooth rotten desserts they do like their sugar there's at least two weeks provisions here damn pass through this ah birthing permission for the echelot that'll come in handy we can take on water oil even ammunition truly the man is a bureau rotic oh the big word oh, i lost 50 hp the man is a bureaucratic bureaucratic. The man is a bureaucratic wizard. <laughs> Bure bureaucratic wizard. Yes, yes. Okay, <laughs> sounds like we all <laughs> get hype saying big words. Sounds like we're all having a little party waiting for us at the ship. A party. We must make for a floor as soon as human humanly possible. No! Well, as soon as possible is at least half a day from now, given the time to load all this. Right. I think we've all earned at least that much of a rest. Let's enjoy it while we can. Alright, cool. So let's go right back in here and see if there's any side quests that we can do currently that might not have to do with the windmill. Alright, so we have to wait till night, because obviously it tells us there's a side quest here, but we can't do it currently because it's not nighttime. So let's walk around for about, I think it takes about 30 seconds. Here we go, yeah, here we go, it's dark time now. Alright, so it's now dark time. Look at that, that blue exclamation mark is there. So what we want to do, obviously save the game before we get merged. Because these side quest bosses are harder than the normal bosses, dude. Like, usually there's one secret side boss that's harder than all the bosses. But there's like, all these side bosses are harder than the regular bosses. It's ridiculous. 
All right, so we got to knock at two second intervals, right? Five knocks over two second intervals. I remember that. Oh, we just got in here. Okay. No problem whatsoever. I wonder if there's any encounters here. So before we go any further, let's see if there's any encounters. The encounter rate is low. The encounter rate is low. All right. It opened. Seems this is the spot mentioned in that memo we found. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, the grand mill works. Gem into the theme. We back with this theme. Oh yeah. I just turned up my 3DS all the way. I don't know why it wasn't up all the way. There's six chests here. The staircase already, but we want to look for hidden items. Remedy. Looks like to get to those two chests over there, we need to come down from the top floor. Probably from the third floor. Yada 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 We'll keep that special for the boss. For him, he needs to deal critical damage. I don't know how to deal. We have to get lucky and do critical damage three times. But if I go, if I, if I give him the merchant's ability to pay to play, he might be able to do massive damage. I, I might do that next time. Okay, look for that. Uh oh, put them hands on him. Put them hands on him. Oh my goodness, these guys have a lot of health. Woo, one shot, bro. And she was guarding, that was good. Great. Let's zap his ass. He has lightning amp, so thunder would be the strongest spell. 422. And that is weak. That's his weak point too. Nice. Good stuff. There's two chests on this floor. On the third floor of the mill. Oh my goodness. Default, 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 brave, brave, default, 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 brave, 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 default, default, default. Act and slash. Brave, brave, brave. Attack, 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 attack. Thunder. Thunder. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, good day. Ooh, goddamn! You see how much damage he did? He did twelve hundred. He did twelve hundred. Twelve hundred. He put them hands to ring a bell. Yo, that strike was ridiculous, dude. We got a lot of high potions, but whoa. Can I use her shield right now? Oh, you can only use it in battle, the shield. Alright, so we're gonna have to use magic outside of battle to be able to cure Ring and Bell. He has some decent defense, too. He got wrecked. Ah, look at this. It looks like a secret path. I thought it was for a second. Man, he got that one hit it quit. He's a one punch chump. Brave. 
We're gonna brave with T Dog. Go all out with Adea. Packy Slash. We're gonna use her hack and slash. We can easily get this back because all she has to do is brave 10 times to get it. And now we'll have her attack. And ring a bell, brave. Nah, let's just have him use Thunder. Get out of here, thug. Get oh, I'm so glad she was blocking. She would have died. Uh. Woo! You dead? I should have sent that attack. I sh I should have sent it. I should have sent that. Get wrecked. All right, now T Dog can go. But what we, what we want to do with her? Kill herself? No, heal everybody. Default. Boom! Look at that. That shield is godlike, dude. Uh. T-Dog, give him the business, T-Dog. <laughs> T-Dog gave him the business. Alright, let's get down here, dude. Nice. That's one chest. It looks like the center staircase from the uh, first floor is going to send us to where we need to go and since we took this other side case staircase we get to these two chests right yes three chests dumbling claws Woo, that sounds good probably wicked than when i got on but let's find out yeah it's wicked than what i got claws that can claw uh claws that can cause blinding on a hit uh we also got a chest we can't even open yet. I'm thinking we have to be a freelancer at level 10 or something to get that chest open. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about doing this. What we want to do, since we have two uh, support abilities open, we can do this. Do 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 A beige. We got raid. Raise BP upon first strike or brave attack. Huh. Black Resonance. Oh, look at this. You have to equip this. I didn't know you had to equip that ability. Black Magic strengthens with each Black Resonance user. Okay. Okay. I get it now. Should we go all Black Magic? Or right, let's see. So ring a bell and T Dog has that ability. What about Anya's? Nope. We can give him this ability, but it would be great if we all had this ability. Then I would run that team and see what would happen. See if we can destroy enemies. All right, let's see. Oh yeah, get ready for the good part. Man, it's a lot of good skills. Angelic Ward. Chance to reduce damage taken. Reduce damage from water. Recover from poison blind and silence at the end. Hmm. Physical attack up. Yeah, we'll equip that two-handed. HP up. Wow, would she need that? Physical defense up. Yeah, let's give her that. Ring a bell. Does he have any good black mage stuff? Oh, wow. Raise max HP by 20%. Let's raise it by 10%. More HP is better. Anya's had nothing equipped? What the hell? Anya's had nothing? Wow, what the hell is going on? Staff lore. 
Don't need that. She's a white mage. She doesn't really have a lot of skills, that's why. Look at that. All her other skills suck. Ally with most HP protects you when HP is critical. That makes sense. Let's give that to her. At least that's better than nothing. Let's give T Dog. Hedge risk. Half the damage you suffer for five turns by spending money equal to half the damage. I don't know about that one. BP drink. Whoa. God speed strike. Unleash an attack that substitutes speed for physical attack and ignores enemy's physical defense. Mug. Deal the same damage. Oh, yeah. Let's give him uh, thievery. Hedaya. We'll give her a miscellany. She's either going to be attacking or examining. Wow. That was insane. I completely forgot about doing those uh, separate abilities after we unlock the wind crystal. So for every crystal that we cleanse, we get we get SP points. So okay, I understand now. I understand. I understand. Do, 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 do. Anya's has nobody. I believe we deleted the person that was linked with Anya's. Team him up. Team her up with Ali. Ali. Ali J. Go to abilities. Look at that. Look at all the abilities we have now. Oh my goodness. Speculate. Inflict either 200% or zero damage. Wow. So deal double damage. Or nothing. Double or nothing, basically. Dungeon Master. Epic group cast. Power of magic does not decline when group casting. Nice. Black Resonance. Huh. Black Resonance. You know what? I'm going to switch our girl... Since we have that ability, I'm going to switch her also to a black mage. We're going to have two black mages. We're going to go to equip optimum. You know what? Better yet, give her the simian staff again. No, the sage's staff. It's not that big of a reduce in magical attack, but the staff raises the amount of damage you do to a multi-target. So yeah, let's keep that on. And what we'll do for her is give her the Black Resonance ability. Black Resonance. We can't give that to her? I don't understand. Why can't we give it to her? Oh, wait! You don't even have to be a Black Mage for that. Oh! So we can keep her as a White Mage. Keep her as a White Mage. But then we can equip that, right? Yup. Wow. That is so ridiculous. We don't even need to be a black mage. <laughs> Yo. This game. This game is done. Oh my goodness. Don't even need to be... A black mage to do that damage. I should probably get rid of divining rod, but I like seeing what how many treasures we have left. So like right next to a boss fight, I'll probably equip him with physical attack up. But right now, oh my goodness. We about to go ham. Ring bell is about to go ham. Like I'm going his am going his am. Alright, default. Better yet. Yeah, attack, attack. Default. Thunder. 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 Let's see how much he does. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go. Magic defense down. Yeah, they're dead now. Yeah, you're dead. Give up. You should have just gave up, man. As soon as you see me put on black resonance, you should have said, Fuck this, dude. I quit. I'm done. I'm done. Saint Lionheart's broke, man. He's broke. All he does is break game. I hate this. I hate it. <laughs> Alright, let's go straight up to center. We can't open that other chest on this floor. Uh, there was another chest. A blue chest. There's three more left. It's just, we can open the blue chest. Here we go. Uh, uh, uh. Put them hands on them, kids. Come on, T Dog. Oh, yeah. That guy resists Thunder. He resisted. Unscathed. The one turned victor. I wonder if there's a way to reduce MP cost. There's gotta be. Probably. Alright, so what we're gonna do here. Since we don't want to be bothered by uh, encounters while we're looking for treasure, we're going to turn off the encounter rate. I think we're high enough level for this. Let's look. Oh, this windmill is crazy, dude. The adventure is right up there. We can pull this lever if we want to. We're going to hold off on doing that, though. There's one chest up here. It's only going to get worse from here on in. Let's save the game. Continue. Doo -doo -doo. Can we go any further? Nope, we got to pull a lever. We got to pull two levers, it looks like. Alright, I see what we got to do. Pull this lever. Na 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 na. There's got to be a secret area somewhere in here. Because there's one more chest we can't even get to right now. Uh, there is the chest, but how do we get to it? Alright, let's see. Boom, go down here. One more chest. Nice. X Potion. Wow, we got an X potion. That's cool. This is leading us back upstairs. Let's keep an eye out for any hidden paths. Look at this. There's a staircase down, and it's also the last chest for this floor. Nice. Right, so we got another high potion, which we rarely use, but we'll use it. We'll use it if like no one can, no one else can heal or whatever. We'll use a high potion. 500 HP too, so it's very good. Until everybody starts breaking the HP limit. If you can break the HP limit in this game. Because it looks like we're gonna beat we're gonna break over a thousand HP. I love games that allow you to break the HP and damage limit in games. I think the first game that I truly enjoyed that was in uh Final Fantasy X. Where they broke the HP limit. It was unheard of. I was like, you can go past 9999? I was so hyped when you uh, when I found that out. Like you could uh, customize equipment, armor, the break damage limits to succeed, to surpass the 9,999 limit. It was fun. All right, cool. So I'm looking at the chat now. It looks like someone said, "Did I miss this chest?" Now, this is one chest we can't open on this floor because it's blue, but someone said to open up the blue chest, you gotta be a rank 10... A rank 10 thief, like I thought. Well, I didn't think it was a thief, but I said we had to be rank 10 for probably uh, for a skill to be able to open the chest. I thought it'd be a merchant or something else, like a freelancer, but it makes sense that it would be a thief. But anyway, without further ado, we are about to go into this... Uh, this fight and what we want to do go to T-Dog really quick go to his abilities 
get rid of that and give him more physical attack. Physical attack up. One more HP. There we go. Let's heal up before we get in here, too. Yeah, 